She's a woman on a mission to share her story of perseverance, and she's proving that living a healthy and active life is possible even after undergoing a double mastectomy. CBS 2's Vanessa Murdoch introduces us to Caroline Plank in today's Coleman Connection. I know it's really, really scary. Try to face it head on. Try to find a, like, a friend out there. Caroline Plank knows cancer all too well. All of my blood aunts on both sides, on my mom's side and my dad's side, all have had breast cancer. She lost her uncle to breast cancer. Her mother is a stage four ovarian cancer survivor. And at just 22, Caroline learned she has the BRCA2 gene mutation, was told it wasn't a matter of if she got cancer, but when. Then, at 28, I found a uh, precancerous tumor, so it in my right breast. She couldn't wait any longer to take a proactive approach to beating breast cancer and opted to undergo surgery, a bilateral mastectomy. She documented her journey in racing against BRCA. It feels like, yeah, like a really, 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 really hard workout. It took six months for her body to fully heal, but all the while she remained determined to run the New York City Marathon less than a year after surgery. Running is her meditation. I wanted to show women you are in charge of your own self, and you know, if you have the will to do something, you can do it. As a Power 30 ambassador for Susan G. Komen NYC, Caroline spreads the word about how the organization helps women and men battling breast cancer. It's very real, and Komen provides support, a community of women, a community that, you know, we find strength in each other. Over the last year, she became a certified health coach and running coach, uses her personal experience expertise and her blog bad lemons to help others bounce back to health and exercise after surgery especially mastectomy take it slow you know don't be freaked out by how it feels because it definitely feels weird she knows the experience can leave you feeling lost but urges don't be discouraged the body is an amazing thing it's gonna heal you're gonna get better surround yourself with love and a friend, old or new, that can help guide you. From Fort Greene, Brooklyn, Vanessa Murdoch, CBS 2 News. So inspiring. Celebrating its 30th year, the Susan G. Komen Greater New York City Race for the Cure takes place virtually starting Saturday, September 12th. You will see Caroline online sharing warm-up exercises and nutrition tips, and you can see she knows what she's talking about. CBS 2 and WLNY TV 1055 are proud sponsors of the race, and for more information, you can head over to cbsnewyork.com. It was so nice to hear that they included the men as well, you know, in this picture because it's such, such important information. For and them. runs in her family, too, yeah, in particular. Definitely. Yeah.